For many centuries, people searching for spiritual growth have embraced fasting as a way to purify and enlighten themselves. Healing practices from various cultures globally have seen fasting as a significant way to rejuvenate the body, mind, and spirit together. Nowadays, scientific studies are proving what people in the past realized. Fasting adjusts the body in special ways that bring about remarkable healing powers. We're going to look into the scientific and philosophical background of this old way of healing. Through fasting, our metabolism undergoes rejuvenation. By fasting, we give our digestive organs a much-needed break, which saves a lot of energy that usually goes into digesting food. This saved energy then helps in self-repair and growing new tissue across our body. With the digestive system taking a rest, the liver starts cleaning up, clearing out toxins and worn-out cells, and increasing the production of stem cells for more intensive repair work. This happens as fasting puts our body into a state where it burns fat, called ketosis, a process our ancestors adapted to during times of plenty and scarcity. Fasting every so often recreates these natural cycles, turning on helpful genes and growth signals in our DNA that are usually turned off by our constant eating habits today. Intermittent fasting acts as an old technique to restart and refresh our bodies. Understanding the science of fasting reveals key bodily changes. The level of insulin in the body significantly drops, allowing fat cells to release stored energy. Growth hormone levels can rise up to five times higher, helping in burning fat and keeping muscles in shape. The body starts ketogenesis, changing its energy source from glucose to fats and ketone bodies, which can supply up to 70% of the brain's energy while fasting. The process of autophagy, where cells clean out damaged parts and waste, gets boosted, aiding in longer life and better health. Research indicates that fasting turns on genes that help us resist stress and illnesses, while dialing down genes associated with aging and sickness. Fasting improves the balance of gut bacteria as the absence of new food stops over-fermentation in the gut, creating a healthier microbial environment. By taking a break from the process of digestion, fasting enables our body's healing and rejuvenation systems to work effectively, helping us regain a balanced state. Global Fasting Customs Throughout history, various cultures and spiritual traditions across the globe have practiced fasting. Famous Greek thinkers such as Plato, Socrates, Aristotle, and Hippocrates all spoke in favor of fasting to improve health and consciousness. In ancient Egypt, the EAS papyrus document touted fasting as a rejuvenation and healing technique. Ayurvedic tradition sees fasting as a way to ignite the digestive energy and clear out toxins. In China, fasting was a method to ensure organ balance and extend lifespan. Similarly, native cultures inherently understood the value of fasting. For example, Native Americans fasted in preparation for hunting, spiritual quests, and significant life changes. In India, fasting was part of coping with food scarcity. African tribes fasted as part of their initiation ceremonies and other important events. Aboriginal Australians would fast while navigating the wilderness. This wisdom of fasting was naturally incorporated into the rituals of native peoples all over the world. Later, major religions like Catholicism, Buddhism, Hinduism, Islam, Jainism and Orthodoxy included fasting for spiritual cleansing. Despite being overlooked in modern times, current scientific findings are backing up the ancient knowledge that fasting detoxifies and revitalizes our physical, mental, and spiritual health. Cleansing through fasting. By fasting, we help our body cleanse itself deeply, giving a break to the overworked digestive system. During fasting, the body burns fat, 
releasing toxins stored in fat cells since no new food comes into process. This process also helps balance the gut's beneficial bacteria, increasing short-chain fatty acids that lower inflammation and boost immunity. The liver enhances its cleaning duties, and the kidneys efficiently remove more impurities from the blood, easing their workload. Autophagy, the body's way of cleaning out cell debris, becomes more effective. This internal cleaning can even improve the skin's appearance, making it look healthier. Fasting acts like hitting a reset button, allowing the body to eliminate built-up waste, aged cells, damaged proteins, and toxins that contribute to early aging. It's like giving your body's cleanup and renewal systems a fresh start. Ketosis, the power of burning fat. At the core of fasting's benefits is ketosis, a state where the body uses fat as its main energy source, offering much more than weight loss. Ketosis leads to a cleaner, more efficient metabolism that brings significant health advantages. Ketones, unlike glucose, result in much lower levels of harmful reactive oxygen species and stress on the body. This state helps protect the brain from aging and disease by improving the performance of mitochondria. Ketones provide energy more effectively than sugars, generating more energy per molecule. By promoting a shift in how our cells operate, from fat creation to brain cell regeneration, ketosis also plays a role in reducing inflammation and can help prevent cancer, since cancer cells can't use ketones for energy. This makes ketosis a powerful cleanser for the body on various levels, helping get rid of toxins, reduce cancer risks, and encourage repair of stem cells. It's clear why our ancestors naturally used this effective energy source during their fasting times. Various intermittent fasting techniques, multiple research-supported intermittent fasting methods can trigger the body's cleansing ketosis process. The 16-8 method has you fast for 16 hours and eat during an eight-hour period each day, matching our natural sleep-wake cycle and giving the digestive system a break at night. Fasting for a full 24 hours, from one dinner to the next, once or twice a week, makes the fasting effect stronger. Fasting on alternate days for 24 to 36 hours helps achieve a deeper ketosis state. Doing water-only fasts from two days up to three weeks demands careful planning but results in thorough cleansing. Setting aside specific times for fasting, like a week every month or season, ensures consistent body detoxification. The goal is to choose a method of intermittent fasting that fits into your life for the long haul, not as a temporary diet fix. By returning to the natural rhythm of periodic fasting and eating, we reconnect with the wisdom of our ancestors and use intermittent fasting as a regular detox practice. Getting ready for fasting. Proper preparation is crucial for a positive fasting journey. Follow these suggestions. Slowly reduce meal sizes and overall food consumption a few days before starting the fast to make the shift smoother. Drink plenty of clean water, herbal teas, and nutrient-rich broths to stay hydrated, aiding the detox process. Ensure you rest well and limit heavy physical activities during the fast to focus your body's energy on healing. If you can, take a break from work and reduce stress as complete relaxation enhances the fasting benefits. Use supplements like electrolytes, vitamins, and minerals if necessary to fill any nutritional gaps. When ending a long fast, reintroduce food gently, avoiding large or heavy meals. Maintain a positive outlook with affirmations and spiritual exercises, as your mindset plays a significant role. A well-planned approach and supportive environment contribute greatly to a restorative fasting experience. Expectations during fasting. Knowing what happens at each stage of fasting can help you prepare. Within the first 12 to 24 hours, your body starts to burn fat and glycogen. 
It's normal to feel mild hunger and crave food. Between the second and third day, you reach full ketosis, reducing hunger and cravings, though you might feel irritable or have headaches as your body's electrolytes rebalance. From day three to five, a stronger state of ketosis diminishes appetite further, and you may notice improved mental focus and signs of the body detoxifying, such as skin issues or the release of mucoid plaque. These signs can come with temporary tiredness or dizziness if the detox happens quickly. In the one to three week mark, the body undergoes significant cleansing and healing, needing extra care. Symptoms like dizziness, irregular heartbeats, and extreme tiredness suggest it's time to stop fasting. Being aware of these phases helps manage physical and spiritual fasting effects with rest, hydration, and mindfulness aiding in rejuvenation. Beginners should ease into fasting with shorter periods and gradually extend them. How to properly end a fast. Ending a fast the right way is just as critical as the fast itself. Follow these guidelines. Avoid eating too much right after fasting. Even when feeling extremely hungry, start reintroducing food slowly, beginning with sips of water or herbal tea, followed by easy to digest foods like fruits, vegetables and yogurt. Move gradually to more substantial foods, steering clear of dense animal proteins, processed items, or sugars initially. Chew thoroughly and eat at a slow pace since your stomach will have shrunk during the fast. The Spiritual Benefits of Fasting Fasting has traditionally been a route to spiritual deepening as it alters awareness and purifies the body. Mental clarity tends to improve with reduced toxin levels. With less energy directed towards digesting food, the mind can focus inward, enhancing intuition and loosening the hold of physical cravings. This state sharpens the senses to finer spiritual vibrations, fostering a control over bodily needs in favor of spiritual insights. Fasting strengthens resolve and the precedence of the spirit over the physical form. It symbolizes an inner cleansing, peeling away superficial layers to unveil a truer self, ready to absorb spiritual wisdom. Many faiths recommend fasting as preparation for sacred occasions to enhance mental and physical readiness for divine experiences. The act of fasting serves as a reminder of one's beliefs and purifies both the mind and body to better channel spiritual energies. Spiritual journeys like pilgrimages, vision quests, and retreats often include fasting to facilitate this deep internal focus. The practice of embracing silence, solitude, and separation from daily distractions opens the door to inner explorations and revelations. Detoxification during fasting. Our bodies collect toxins from various sources, including food, drinks, the environment, and substances we consume. Over time, our natural detox systems can get overwhelmed. Fasting offers these systems a pause, allowing them to clear out accumulated toxins. The liver, kidneys, skin, lungs, and colon ramp up the removal of waste, some of which may have been stored for a long time. Fasting causes the release of chemicals stored in fat, such as pesticides or drug residues, improving gut health and reducing inflammation. Symptoms like headaches, tiredness, muscle pain, skin breakouts, nasal congestion, cough, excessive sweating, stomach upset, and changes in breath or tongue appearance might indicate the body is getting rid of toxins. These signs typically diminish after a few days. Drinking plenty of fluids, getting enough rest, and supporting the body's waste elimination can ease this process. If these symptoms worry you, it's wise to seek medical advice. Handling fasting side effects. While fasting is generally safe, some may experience side effects, such as low blood sugar, leading to feelings of instability, weakness, or confusion. Drinking herbal tea or taking mineral supplements can mitigate these effects. An imbalance in electrolytes can cause headaches, tiredness, or muscle spasms. Using mineral-rich broths or electrolyte supplements can help balance this. 
Dehydration, recognized by thirst and lightheadedness, is prevented by increasing water intake. If you feel dizzy when standing up, move slowly to avoid falls. Gallstones may also become problematic, requiring medical attention if the pain intensifies. With the right approach and gradual start, most of these side effects can be minimized. Beginners should take fasting step by step, advancing carefully to ensure safety. Individuals who should avoid fasting. Fasting is beneficial for many, but not everyone should participate. This includes people who are malnourished or too thin, kids younger than 12, pregnant or nursing mothers, individuals dealing with gout or elevated uric acid levels, anyone with eating disorders, those who have severe diabetes or unstable blood sugar, and people taking certain medications. Also, those with liver or kidney issues, low blood pressure, or inflammatory bowel diseases like ulcerative colitis or Crohn's disease should refrain from fasting. Anyone with existing health problems should seek advice from a medical professional before starting a fast. It's important to proceed with caution and listen to how your body reacts. Incorporating fasting into daily life. To reap fasting's full rewards, it should be woven into your everyday life as a consistent habit. Here's how to make fasting a long-term commitment. Choose a fasting schedule that fits seamlessly with your life and doesn't feel like a burden. Avoid fasting too frequently. Limiting yourself to two or three fasts per week during daylight hours is a good rule of thumb. Schedule your fasting times during quieter, more relaxed periods. Engage in gentle activities, contemplation, or meditation to stay focused during fasting. When breaking a fast, opt for nutritious foods rather than indulging in heavy meals or processed snacks. Ensure proper hydration and consider supplements to support your nutritional needs. Keeping a fasting journal can help you monitor the changes you experience, both mentally and physically. Enhance your fasting experience by pairing it with activities that connect you to nature, promote relaxation and support physical well-being like spending time outdoors, receiving massages or visiting a sauna. Regular fasting becomes a tribute to the timeless health wisdom passed down through generations, offering profound benefits for modern lives. Reflective Insights To wrap up, fasting serves as a comprehensive route towards restoration and complete well-being. On a physical level, it initiates detoxification processes that rejuvenate cells. Mentally, it fosters clearer thinking and greater mindfulness. Emotionally, it helps let go of deep-seated habits and urges. Spiritually, it aids in discovering inner truth and connecting more deeply with the divine. Fasting guides us in mastering ourselves fully, body, mind, and spirit. Passed down from ancestors, its efficacy lies in its practice across ages. When approached properly, fasting rejuvenates our energy and unleashes our true potential. Pay attention to what your body communicates. Its natural ability to heal can lead the way during fasting. Let your journey with intermittent fasting be filled with growth and revitalization.